All right, today we're going to talk about um, pulling out guides to use to help you in some of your drawing techniques, shapes, and stuff like that. So the first thing we need to do is to turn on our rulers. Uh, this is one way that we can do it. Um, so we'll go view. <laughs> we'll go view, show rulers, or the keyboard shortcut for that is command R. And that's just something that you get in the habit of doing. So command R to turn on rulers. And we could click up here in the ruler area. You just want to click on that ruler and drag to pull out your guide. Now if you happen to be dragging a horizontal guide and you decide you want to turn it into a vertical, all we have to do is hit down option, a hold down option, and it allows us to flip. So if we're pulling a vertical and we hit option, it'll flip it. And we can move any of these guides with our move tool. Keyboard shortcut for that is V for move. And all we have to do is click on it. You'll see how your cursor turns into this little double-sided arrow icon and you just click and drag it. All right, I've got too many guides here, so I'm going to clear all these guides. So what I want to do is click on View, and we'll say Clear Guides. Another way that we can create guides in our document is to go up here to View, and pull down to New Guide. And this is real nice if you want to put guides exactly in the center of your document. I know my document is 10 inches by 10 inches, so I'm going to say put one at 5 inches, a vertical, and then I'll say view, new guide, change it to horizontal, and I'll change this to 5 inches. And it puts that guide directly in the center. And if we want to lock guides, we go up under view and say lock guides. Now when I hover over these guides, I cannot move them. I can move my background, but I'm not going to be able to move my guides, which is real handy once you have everything set up. And you want to know why we would use guides? Well, sometimes we want to draw shapes and we want to draw from the center. So we know exactly right where to click. I can click right there and drag out a shape if I wanted to. The other thing I wanted to tell you about is that we can always reset the origin to this center. If we go up here and look, um, our guide is at 5 inches, 0 is over here in the left hand corner, 10 in the right hand corner. But what if I wanted my 0, 0 or my origin to be set right at the center of those guides? Well, we can do that. All we have to do is go up here to where our rulers meet each other, right here in the corner, and we're just going to drag that, click and drag, and we'll bring that right into the center and let go. And now you see that our guide, that where they intersect, is at zero and zero. And then if you want to get that back to where it was, all we have to do is go back up here to the corner and just double click on that little origin button. All right, I think that's it on guides. Good luck. Play around with them and um, have fun.